these are some tips for if you're running two or more businesses at once. I would say, first of all, tr don't do it. <laughs> you know, it's, it's not a good idea. Uh, the reason I sold my agency was because my business partner and I could just couldn't successfully run two businesses at once. And we didn't really start winning until we chose to double down and focus on Proposify and get rid of our agency. Um, I think the entrepreneurs who uh, are the best at what they do are the ones that go very narrow and very deep, right? Like if you look at the Zuckerbergs and Spiegels and Steve Jobs and Gary Vaynerchuk, like most of them have been hustling at one business, maybe two, for decades, right? They might have little uh, side projects or they might be doing some investing on the side, but generally you're like toiling away on the one thing if you want to make the biggest impact. I think down the road, once you've got some wins under your belt, you can look at, uh, you know, kind of like bands that have their main band, like Radiohead, but then they also do a, a side, you know, uh, album or something with another group. It's like their mistress. But in general, I don't believe that any entrepreneur, especially when you're starting out and you have very little resources and time and, and money, can you can you just kill it in two businesses simultaneously? I don't think it can be done. If, if you're especially good and you've got the resources to do it, like you can start a business and then get a partner or get a management team and just have them execute while you just, you know, come in every quarter and keep tabs on uh, on the reports and the metrics. But in terms of like, can you run two businesses and go from zero to a successful multi-million dollar company, both you know, at once, I, I don't think that's possible for most people.